How to prepare your portfolio for Kingston? Just from the beginning, you will have to know that each university has particular requirements that are quite different from a school to another. Today, we will talk about how to prepare your portfolio for Kingston. Your book should feature examples of research and development of your ideas and projects. Be sure to arrange your work in a particular way. Make your portfolio presentable and well-organized and even think of your format. Is it landscape or portrait? You want to submit works on a square format, a white paper, a colored one or a black one. Present your creative journey so that one can know you better and understand your personality and what your interests are. Show your potential. You are good in illustrations? Show it. You like drawing and folding? Present this in your book. You are a crafty person? Prove it. Present your sketchbooks and your journals. The thing that inspire you. Show the creative process. Show goods and bads and motivate your choice. Explain them why you choose one subject or another, why you consider something went bad and how you can improve this in the future. Mood boards, mind mapping, research, everything is important to prove you have potential. Demonstrate your skills and your own artistic awareness. Study trends, see Vogue online, read about fashion forecast, WGSN or latest technologies. About how to arrange your book. To grab the attention, start in force, present your best works at the beginning. Show materials, techniques, paintings, drawings, digital works or written work. End your portfolio as you begin it, with your strongest work, so that teachers will remember you and feel excited about your talent. Don't work sloppy. Have everything in order, put together your things and present your best works. Keep in mind that they are looking for quality over quantity. Show them you enjoy fashion and if you are implicated in different projects, mention this too. Talk about your works, explain each piece of work if required. As about technical requirements, make sure you read them carefully. If they ask for a file less than 50 MB, do not send larger formats. Hope this helped. Good luck and stay tuned for my next videos about how to prepare your works for a fashion university. Waiting for your comments below to know if you find this kind of video useful. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe, like and share my video. See you next time!